Wednesday. I just wanted to show you guys the sunset from my house. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my goodness, that is so gorgeous. I never actually, never actually paid attention to it, but I was just in Nyla's room and I seen that, that it was a sunset. It's beautiful. And look, all the snow is melting. <laughs> it's all melting, y'all. <laughs> Good morning, sleepyhead. Hey, Nyla Beasy. Hey. Good morning. <laughs> Hi. It's time to get up, love bug. Nyla. <laughs> She's still knocked out, you guys. She's not having it. <laughs> She's like, I am still sleeping, Ma. You hear Barbie? <gasps> you hear Barbie? Yep. Yep. You want me to turn the light off so your eyes adjust? <gasps> you want me to turn off the light so your eyes adjust? Yep. Yep. Hey guys, I gotta turn the light off so her eyes can adjust properly. Is that better? Huh? Is that better? Huh? Yep. <laughs> Do you see this, guys? We're making lemonade. Lemonade, lemonade. Don't shake the yeah, don't shake it. Just keep it still. Now, don't you think that's cool? <laughs> Ooh! Huh? Making lemonade, you guys. No. But it was just. Too, don't open that. Yesterday, I said, like, right down a little bit. It was just way too much to be holding it and trying to squeeze. Y'all yeah, know you gotta squeeze the water out of the Poland Spring bottle. Because I don't do the tap water thing. It's just too many things that comes through the tap. And we had a filter, but the filter broke, so I have to get a new filter. So. <laughs> Making lemonade. <laughs> Y'all, I'm making breakfast for me and Mike. <laughs> Look at this big old bag of pancake you got. Pancake mix. <sighs> you think we're going to be able to finish this? I don't make pancakes that often. But. Ugh. It's a family size. <laughs> got it from Wally Mart? No. I don't remember where I got it from. I think I got it from Walmart or Price Right. I, one of them. Anyway, the kiddos are off to school. Michael just took them. So I'm making some breakfast for me and Mike. And guys, I gotta show you what he, um, what Big Daddy, Big Daddy, that's what I call him. I gotta show you what he got me this morning, you guys. So romantic, so sweet. It may not be romantic to you guys, but this is something that I absolutely just, it warms my heart. And so, oh, I see them 
opening up already. So he came home this morning from work and he came home with a beautiful card, beautiful card that kind of just, you know, just reminds us of what we fell in love with from each other and the things that we fell in love with and that we are still so much more in love now than ever before. And then he got me a plant, you guys. I thought it were I thought they were flowers, but it turned out to be plant, a plant of my favorite flower. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. And it smells amazing. So he got me white hydrangeas. Oh my goodness. Isn't this beautiful, you guys? Oh. Like, I absolutely love hydrangeas. They are my favorite, favorite flower. I had them at my wedding in pink and purple. Oh my goodness, they're so beautiful, so delicate. They smell so good. And they're actually opening up a little bit because I put some water in them this morning. It just, oh, I just love them. I just love them so much. Like, can you see how beautiful they are? You guys are so beautiful. You're so beautiful. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You're so beautiful. You're beautiful. You're strong. You're healthy. And you're growing nicely. Yay! I love my plant. I love my plant. And you know, they say that if you speak positivity over your plants, that they will actually grow strong and beautiful and full and stuff. I, I truly believe that because the power of words is awesome, amazing. And if you actually do speak positivity over your life, over your children, over your finances, over everything in your life, you get positive, you know, positive, um, uh, you'll reap, reap, oh, reap positivity from whatever it is that you're speaking over. So... I also got to show you the card that he got me, you guys. It's so beautiful. And I just have to read it. It says, when I think about what it means to be us, I think about when we first met and how happy and in love we are. I think about how we were. I think about our journey, how far we've come, how much we've shared, and how many special moments we've known between then and now. Ugh. When I think about what it means to be us, I think about how much we genuinely enjoy being with each other and how lucky we are. Because when I think about what it means to be us, I think about how much I loved you then, how much I love you now, and how much I'll always love you. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I just love that! It's so like he's he gives me like the most amazing cards, but that is just so sweet. It, it there's it's there's no anniversary, no birthdays, it's just because and it just feels good, you guys. It feels great to be appreciated, it, it feels great, you know, because you can go through life and do so much, and you know, life can just take you on a whirlwind. But it's like these little things that makes me happy. It's not jewelry. It's not the most outrageous name brand pocketbook or shoes or anything like that. Stuff like this. Cards, letters, a flower, flowers picked from a garden, plants. Like those are the things that are romantic to me. You know what I mean? Long walks. Yeah. Spending time together and just appreciating each other so if you haven't appreciate appreciated someone today appreciate somebody you guys somebody you love you know appreciate the one that you're with a family member let me tell you something it goes a long way when somebody can say I appreciate you being in my life like that is it's priceless you guys it's priceless hello Put it in the sink, please. Okay. Put it in the sink. I did. Nyla. Yeah. Put the fork down in the sink. I did. You did not. I did. Put it in the sink, please. <laughs> Put it down. Good job. Thank you. Yeah, okay. Now, all right.
Mikey had Clorox wipes up his nose, yeah? No, I didn't. Don't believe him. Uh, what? Kayla my hands is are hot. Feel my hands. Your hands are cold. They're hot. They're cold. How are they cold? Because they're cold. Michaela is not hot. She's totally fine. Ain't nothing wrong with her. And just a little She's bit just tired. And warm. And warm. She's just a little bit warm. Drinking some tea, you guys. And warming up some dinner for the kiddos. Warming up some din din for the kiddos. Nala, can you leave that, please? She's taking everything out the plate rack. Nala, put that back, baby. Okay. Please, put it back. She takes everything out the plate rack and put it in the sink. <laughs> everything that I just wanted. <laughs> she puts it in the sink. Anyway, so how are you guys? How is your day? I think I only vlogged maybe once or twice today. Happy Fantabulous Wednesday. <laughs> Nyla, leave that. I did. Yeah, so today was a really, really great day, you guys. Like, I had so much fun. Michael and I, we just, we hung out today. <laughs> and we, um, we drove to, like, a different county. And, you know, then we had lunch. And it just, it just was so good. Like, we had a really good conversation and it just was really good you guys and man it's like almost 12 years of marriage and being together for 15 years it's amazing that we still can have conversations with each other and it's not boring it's not dull you know what I mean it's it's full of life and like I'm just today was just a really really great day coming from being down and out and sick for two weeks and being able to just get out the house and just breathe in that toxic air <laughs> it felt good <laughs> you know because there's so much pollution in the air yeah but it just felt really good to just get out the house and just um just get some air, you know, from being sick for two weeks. But anyway, I'm sure you guys don't want to hear me rant and rave about being sick for two weeks. We are completely fine now. Everybody's doing better. Everybody's feeling better. So we're doing fine. So how was your guys' days? Wait, that's not even English. How was your day? <laughs> Today. Today. Guys, I'm so tired. I'm so sleepy. Do I know what that means? Um, no. Are you going to tell me? Don't say finish my sentence. Huh? Once I finish my sentence. Once you finish your sentence. Guys, she's a lefty. She writes with her left hand. Isn't that cool? Oh my gosh. I don't have anybody in my family that I know of that's left hand. Did. And she's a lefty. Like, we're all righties. I think Michael's brother is a lefty. Um, yeah, he is, and I'm a righty too. And my daddy's brother's a righty too. She writes with both her left hand and her right hand. She's stronger with her left hand. But isn't that amazing? It's just so cool to see. Like I love to see her right, her little hands. Her little hands. Guys, you guys know that they go to three different schools right now. You know, do you know this? And I'm so happy to say that we just got their school letter for September. And they're all going to the same school. Oh all three of them, they're going to the same school in September. You know how easy that's going to make my life. Ugh. Because we don't have to drop them to three different schools in the morning and pick them up three different times. Well, how Nala gets the go, bus taken. How are we going to get we're taking you guys. We're going to drive you to school and pick you back up. Though you can walk to school because it's literally right around the corner. We're walking.
walking to school by yourselves? Not by yourselves. Myself or Daddy will take you. So we're taking the car? Mm-hmm. Can we walk there? In the summertime. Why? When it's warm. Because who wants to walk in the winter? Daddy. Oh, walk by yourself then. <laughs>